Culture Talk, like, share, subscribe. Listen, I want to talk about uh, the SCOTUS seat in Ecomi Barrett. Uh, I want to talk about how I feel about this whole thing and where I think uh, the senators, the Democratic senators are uh, making fools of themselves and they're going off of, uh, how would I say, speculation and it's sad. It's just sad to watch. Before I get into that, make sure you like, share, subscribe to the page. Uh, you know, if you wanna donate, cash app, links in the description. Anyway, all right, so let's get into it, man, real quick. All right, so Amy, Amy, Amy Cody Barrett is uh, going up for the Supreme Court uh, justice seat, uh, replacing Ruth Bader Ginsburg. She is, um, uh, I would say, overqualified for this position. And I think that she is going to do good. See, the thing is, see, here's the thing that makes me mad about this whole this whole situation is she was appointed because she's qualified for the position. But Democrats, of course, the good old Democrats, the good old Democrats, they just got to make up stories or something that goes along with a narrative. So let me put this out there. I'm going to start with Cory Booker. And I'm not going to go through all the, um, the Democratic senators. I'm just going to start with Cory Booker. You guys got to stop making this about race. This woman has two black children. For you to ask her, do she condemn white supremacy? You sound dumb as hell. You sound dumb. Dumb. For you to say that. That doesn't make any sense. Does she condemn white supremacy? What does that have to do with anything? Has nothing to do with nothing. And you and you go on with this, oh, there's systemic racism going on. Listen, Corey, your party started it, man. I don't know why you guys always bring this talking point up when y'all started it. Whether whether it's systemic racism, whether the, the, the Republicans doing it, whatever. Y'all started it. This woman doesn't write no legislation. She does not write no laws. How are you asking her about things that you guys write? This is so crazy to me how how this happens. It's like, so y'all write the laws, y'all write the legislation, but you're asking her about it. But you wrote it. Not you, but y'all wrote it. See, the problem with them is the Democrats. Well, let me just get into the other one from Hawaii, Hirono. You're stupid. Are you going to ask this woman, has she ever committed sexual assault on someone? What are, you, what are you talking about? What are you talking about? What does that have to do with anything? Then you turn around and ask her, you know, have she basically taken any bribes for money? Stupid. Just more stupidness. Then you turn around. What was the other thing you said that was just like way out of control? And I'm like, what? What? What is this? I'm like, what is this? Like, see, people like her, I don't think that they think these things through. Oh, she said, she said, using the term uh, uh, sexual preference is basically like a hate, a hate crime or race, racial slur or hate speech. Man, this is so crazy to me how no one actually calls these people out. And it's like, what are you talking about? How is that hate speech? How is that? Oh, that's an old term. I I never I never knew that that was an old term. I hear, hear people talking about that all the time. I hear I hear gay people talking about that all the time. And it's like, here's the thing, right? And then and then the other one, I don't even remember her name. 
uh, Amy is Amy K. I'm gonna say Amy K. She asks the stupidest questions too. They ask stupid questions. Did you know Trump said this? Did you know Trump said this? Did you know Trump said this? Did you know, like, everybody knows Trump said it. Like, what are you trying to link? Like, if 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 she would have said yes, how does that make it, make it or break it? Like, it's no difference. If she would have said yes, I knew Trump said it because he posted it everywhere. Does that make her guilty? Like, that that's stupid. That's stupid. Y'all ask dumb questions. Instead of asking her how she's going to govern, this, all, this whole thing is all about Trump. Trump, 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 Trump. Not asking her, what is she going to do? You know, how is she going to be fair or whatever? Now, you, here's the thing. This is why they can't get around her. Because she's an originalist, she calls herself. Right? So, now watch the whole thing. And she's pretty good. She's an originalist. First of all, let's just put this out there. This chick went there with no notes. She had no notes. That's a big deal. I think a lot of people believe, like, a lot of people believe that, you know, all of these these, these so-called uh, politicians and senators, they got books and books and books, and they, they flip and do panels and books and books. She had no notes, and she was going off the top. I can imagine if she brought notes. She was going off the top and killing y'all she was smoking y'all off top so that right there to me was a big deal then you had kamala harris who's a numbskull asking dumb questions like and it's like we know what you're doing kamala like you need to just stop we know what you're doing you only doing this because you're trying to put your bid in because we know Joe Biden's not going to be the president. So we try, you're trying to put your bid in. Like, y'all made this into a political thing. This wasn't even about her. Because y'all can't touch her. Her, her record is bulletproof. Y'all can't touch her. So what y'all do is y'all try to link her to Trump. To might try to make it seem like she knew something. Or she has a hidden agenda. This lady clearly said it a lot about 30 times. That she doesn't have a, a, an agenda. And y'all keep asking her the same question. The same question. The same question. Well, here's my thing, right? Here's why I say y'all a bunch of frauds. Democrats. Check this out. So, they want to pack the court, what they call it, right? Pack the court. Which means they want to add two more justices. So, it'll be 11 instead of 9, right? So, here's what they want to do. They want to put... They want to appoint people who doesn't really follow the Constitution, who goes off of how they feel because every question that Cory Booker asked her, every question that Hirono asked her, all of these questions, all of these people asked her, it all came down to how do you personally feel? And she told them, it's not about my personal feelings. I go by what the Constitution says. And they can't get around that. They can't get around it. So what they want to do is they want to appoint two people, two judges that they believe is going to be more more on their side when it comes to expressing your feelings instead of going by the Constitution. This is what they want to do. This is what they want to do. So when they say stuff to her and ask her these questions and she constantly tells them, I go by what the, what, what, I go by what the text say. You can't get around that. You can't. So if she's going exactly by the Constitution, how are y'all, why do y'all want to pack the court or why do y'all want to add two more justices? For what? For what? Because the reason why y'all want to do it, y'all want to pack the court or y'all want to add two more justices because y'all know for a fact, y'all know for a fact that she's going to go by the book and y'all can't stand it. Y'all can't stand it. This is why you asking her, that's why y'all asking her questions Y'all asking her questions about things that has nothing to do with the Constitution. How, how would she handle this? She's like, well, the, I can't give you that answer. It, 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 that's like, that's has to be in place. I can't. Man, listen, torture talk. 
Like, share, subscribe to the page. Hey, man, listen, man. She's going to get the nod. And y'all know she's going to get the nod. Y'all just butt hurt because of what happened with Obama. That's what it is. And that's it. Like, share, subscribe to the page, man. You know what it is.